this is Sammy Styles here with another hair review. Woohoo! <laughs> All right, as you can see on the title, this is another hair review on this Pure Clarity hair. Now let's get down to it. I decided to do a second review on this hair. Everybody needs a second chance, right? <laughs> so let's get back, let's get down to it. Now, I, on my last video, I advised that I had four bundles in my hair, 24, 22, 20, and an 18. If you did not see my last video, I will put the link in my description box. Please check it out. It's the initial first review. Now, after going into my hair closet and pulling out the hair, I decided to bring this hair back to life. I had a lot of trouble with this hair in my previous video, you could see. So I decided to soak this hair in silicone mix for 24 hours. Now, after soaking it for 24 hours, I found out who the problem child was. And that was the 24 inch bundle. That's why I was shedding all over the place. I've noticed after sink, sinking, 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 soaking, <laughs> after soaking the hair for 24 hours in silicone mix, all the other three bundles were perfect except this hair. This particular hair is still rough, it's still shedding, look, it's still tangled. So I decided to install the hair without the 24 inches. So right now in my head, I have the 22, the 20, and some of the 18. So I have like two and a half bundles in my hair, which my hair is still pretty full, which is perfect. This hair is sewed on. I have a side part with some leave out, out on a weaving cap. So let's go down to the pros and cons. My pros are still the same. This hair has a beautiful pattern. This hair right now is in a natural state. I didn't wand curl it or anything. I co-washed it this morning and it air dried. So this is the um, results from the air drying. I put a little bit of oil to give it a little bit of shine and that's about it. Now, um, any other pros I would say is it holds a curl, still holds a curl. Uh, when I when I do go out, I do wand curl the top of my hair so it could blend in the side of my hair. Or I will get all happy and, and wand curl the whole thing because I like different types of curl patterns. Now, that's about the only thing when it comes to the pros with this hair, honey child. <laughs> so the cons, <sighs> okay. Now, this hair is a lot of maintenance. If you are somebody who does not want to deal with your hair, you don't want to deal with shedding. This is not the hair for you. This hair still sheds. Even though I got rid of the problem child, which is the 24 inch bundle, I still experience shedding. I don't experience excessive shedding, but I do experience shedding. I still find sh hair, shedding hair in my kitchen, in the fridge, in my car, but it's not as bad as it was before. I would give the shedding maybe a five of how much hair that I have shedding, which is not bad, but to me it's kind of annoying because I've experienced different hair, so I know the quality of hair and how it should be. Now, this hair has to be co-washed every week. Nobody got time for that. <laughs> every single week. I co-wash my hair every Friday. I try every Thursday or Friday. By the fifth day, the hair is a burden's nest. I can't put my hand through it. I can't do nothing to it. This hair is never combed. The only time I comb my hair is when I co-wash it in the um, in the shower or if I wash it in a sink or whatever. And when I do wash my hair, this is the result of washing it and combing it. This is the amount of shedding that comes out of the hair. You can see. Now also, I will insert a picture of the shedding from my previous wash last week. Each and every co-wash, this is the amount of hair that I receive. It's not good beer clearly yet. Rest in peace hair. <laughs> Let me tell you, this is horrible because I am in fear that my sink will be clogged <laughs> by the time I take this thing out. I try to be very cautious when I wash my hair because so much hair comes out and the shedding is just, it's not good. And if I don't co-wash the hair, I notice that, like I stated earlier, it's a bird's nest, it's really rough, the curl pattern is gone, and it's really stiff. I, j 
just me personally, I don't feel like this is something that's worth three, four hundred dollars. That's just my opinion. I personally would not pay this money. I would rather just go to AliExpress. At least with AliExpress is a little bit cheaper and you know what your expectations is of AliExpress and you're saving a couple bucks. <laughs> So I would personally say I will not purchase this curl pattern from this company. I am a little hesitant from purchasing from this company again. Will I? Right now, I'm on the fence about it. Maybe a different curl pattern, but right now, no. I've seen other curl patterns. I haven't seen anybody complain, but like I stated in my other video, I haven't really seen a lot of people purchase this curl pattern, which is fine. I decided to go on a limb and get this curl pattern. I'm experimenting for you guys, I guess. Um, but unfortunately, I, I, I'm not gonna have this in my hair for long. I haven't straightened out this hair. I've been up and down about straightening out this hair. Please leave a comment if you think I should straighten it, if you wanna see how it looks straightening. Maybe it's a little less maintenance, I don't know. Probably when I'm about to take it off, I will probably straighten it to see how it looks. Probably have it for a week and after that, take out this bundle. I've had this hair for two months now and I've washed it every single week, which is too much for me. This is too much because say it's a day that I miss, my hair will literally have to go in a bun because it looks horrible. It looks dry, flaky. It's just, it does not look good. When I co-wash it each time, I co-wash it with silicone mix and I co-wash it with um, Gratis Garnier. Um, they're pretty good. They they bring they bring the hair to life. I'll put the name in the description of the two products that I do use. I don't put no product in my hair. Maybe a little shine here or there, because this hair already is so much maintenance. I'm scared to put stuff in it, and that's a shame that you pay all this money for hair. You're scared to put stuff in it. I hope this video was helpful. Unfortunately, I will not. That's it. I'm not putting this hair back in my head again. Most likely, I'll probably either maybe do a wig or give it away or throw it. I don't know. I just I'm, I'm, I'm finished with this hair. I decided to do it for a second chance because I feel like every hair deserves a second chance. And I paid all that money for the hair and it was a shame to throw it out. And I felt like any hair could be brought to life. I feel like this hair could be brought to life temporarily. And if you do have the money, I think there's so much other companies out there to purchase from. Look, I'm shaking and my hair is stiff. Shake, 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 shake. Okay, I'm sorry. <laughs> and um, yeah, that's my overall overview. This was just a short video to let you know how this hair is. Am I happy with my purchase? Not really. I'm happy that I'm able to get a second install in. But to think about it, I purchased this hair in March and we're only in July and I don't feel like I got my money's worth. Usually in my hair closet, I have hair for years or two and they're still in perfect condition. So I will not recommend this hair. My, my status still stands from our first video. So please guys, make sure you comment, like, and subscribe. If you have any other questions, please, please, please put your questions in the comments below and I will answer all of your questions. Thank you so much for your support and for watching. Peace and love lovers. Oh, and remember to follow me on Instagram at SammyStyles underscore. Peace and love lovers.